into this short tutorial about how to insert a live object, a live link within a PowerPoint and within Microsoft Word. This is useful when you have data that is forever changing. That it, it makes sure that the user is getting the most up to date data without somebody having to physically update multiple different areas. This can lead to human error and also just the fact that people forget to do it. So first of all in Microsoft PowerPoint we click on object, we click on create from file, we click browse and we find the one that we, we would like to embed. So for this one, I'm going to say customers. And I'm going to put link there. That, that there says insert a picture of the file content into your presentation. The picture will be a shortcut to the file. So that changes to the file will be reflected in this presentation. Okay, so this will look like a very simple spreadsheet. And it will have a, a direct link to my other spreadsheet. Now, obviously, I wouldn't place this in a PowerPoint normally because it's very difficult to read. Okay, but it's good for uh, the purposes of this presentation. To you, to the naked eye, that just looks like a list of data. Doesn't really matter what it is. What will happen now, though, is if I change that data, this slide will change automatically without me having to come back in and change it. Okay, I can also do this with a Word document. If I go to create from file again, and I'll insert this bit of guidance here on uh, on user requirements. It takes its time to come through. It's quite a lot of data to bring through. And obviously it's creating those links so that when it does update, it brings it through with it. Okay, and there is that data. Okay, I can resize it down a little bit. It fits in. Okay, obviously you've noticed that it's gone slightly squashed rather than stretched. But that means that that's updated. Now, if I change the title, for instance, that will change on this presentation, which is really useful for a business. Okay, so that's PowerPoint. Let's have a look at Microsoft Word. Microsoft Word is exactly the same process. That's the beauty of Microsoft. Is I go to Insert, and I'm looking for Object again. You'll notice it looks quite similar, but not exactly the same. Create from File, Browse. I'm going to bring in this spreadsheet like I did last time. And I'm going to do Link to File and it will bring through that spreadsheet. Now I could bring through uh, a PDF, I could bring through a, a an image, I could bring through a variety of different formats. Let's take a look at what formats I could bring through. Okay, Any of these here, I could bring through just a graph from Excel, uh, or I could bring through a certain package, or a Microsoft WordPad document, open document text, variety of different things there, but the key being is that you can show that you have done this, you clicked, link to file and that inserts the contents of the file into your document and creates a shortcut to the source file changes to the source file will be reflected in your document if you don't click that all you're doing is inserting a static image and you might as well have just taken a screenshot i hope that that's been useful thank you very much for watching